of disc disease is a broad term used to describe several conditions that can occur in the maturing spine. As we age, our discs, which are the pads between the two individual vertebra, start to change their protein content to where they have less water in them. They become less spongy and more, well, I guess the real term would be like crab meat. They don't absorb the bounce as much and people can feel discomfort from that alone. But sometimes that disc, as it loses its water content, will bulge backwards and touch on a nerve then they can have pain that goes down their leg. If that happens at the L5-S1 segment, that's sciatica. Many people have had a family member or a friend that's had that. Degenerative disc disease itself really isn't a disease per se, but more a description of what's happening to the spine as it loses that water content. And how we treat conditions that are associated with this broad term are gonna be very specific to what that disc is doing to that patient. If you're having a lot of axial pain, or pain in the back, from the back, then physical therapy, strengthening your core muscles, the use of non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medications, and some general activity recommendations that we might make. Avoid the combination of bending, twisting, and heavy lifting. Now, if the digerum disc is pressing on a nerve and you have pain going down your leg, perhaps numbness or even weakness, then we might wanna treat that with strengthening those core muscles but also addressing the pathology at the nerve level with steroid injections, perhaps uh, a bit of therapy, physical therapy, oral steroids, and as a last resort, taking the pressure off of the nerves with surgery.